What's up guys, my name is Ariana and today I'm going to take you through a very few easy, easy steps regarding image optimization for your website. As beginners, we don't always understand what we're doing and we just grab some royalty-free image online hoping that it will fit perfectly and that's it. Here's the thing though, if the dimension of the photo is too small, the website is going to try to stretch it to make it fit and it's just going to end up looking too blurry or pixelated. But now, if you also grab an image that is too large, your website is going to try to shrink it by cropping it or resizing it and the photo in the end is just going to lose its quality. All of it wastes both data and bandwidth and not only that, but the page loading time increases and that ultimately drives people away. Now, here's how we fix this issue and let's just assume that you already know the display size of your images. Numero uno, crop and resize. This is a very easy trick that you can do directly from your WordPress. All you need to do is head to one of your posts or page, click on the image that you will wish to scale and then you will be able to edit from there. Also, with the new block system that WordPress has, you will have a panel on the right side to select the style, play with more settings, or even do some advanced CSS coding. But let's just not get into that part. Numero 2. Adjusting the dimensions on the media settings. Just head to the settings on your left sidebar, then media, and voila! From there, you can adjust the maximum dimension to use when uploading an image to WordPress. These are going to be for each of the options that it will present to the browser. I will also mention that this will allow you to improve the loading time of your website, but not necessarily optimize your image in every circumstance. With that being said, numero 3. Use an image editor, and I'm sure the first thing that comes to your mind is Photoshop, and you're probably right. Although, if you don't have access to Photoshop, you can also go for a different option like Photopea, which works pretty much the same and is free. All you'll need to do is go on image, then image size and play with the settings in there. Now, if you want to even compress the photo just a little bit without losing the quality, go to file, then export as and play there with the percentage. Anything all the way down to 80% or 70% should still keep a neat quality of the image. But hey, is WordPress, so let's just throw in some plugins. Optimal or Short Pixels are great options. They will basically grab one single image and adjust the dimensions according to the browser's request and will basically make your life easier overall. They're pretty neat and worth looking into. Now, because sharing is caring, do you have any tips or tricks to optimize the images on your website? Let us know in the comment section below. Have an awesome one and I'll see you next time.